Long before civilization, humans lived in caves, seeking shelter, protection and resources. Caves are therefore natural time capsules, preserving traces of the past that can tell us about the culture, technology and art of the people who inhabited them. One of these caves is the Lagama Cave Complex. The Lagama Cave Complex is located in the municipality of Ribamontorn al Monte in Spain's Cantabria province. It is one of the most important archaeological sites in Europe as it contains a wealth of prehistoric art, fossils and artifacts that span from the Lower Paleolithic to the Bronze Age. The cave complex is divided into several galleries each with its own characteristics and secrets. One of them, known as the Upper Gallery is especially remarkable as it preserves one of the best preserved floors from the Paleolithic period containing more than 4,000 fossils and more than 500 graphical units. The Upper Gallery was used by Magdalenian hunters and gatherers who lived between 17,000 and 12,000 years ago. They were skilled artisans who made tools and ornaments from stone, bone, antler, and shell. They also hunted large animals, such as deer, horse, bison and aurochs and collected marine resources from the nearby coast. But what makes the upper gallery so unique is that it contains a Paleolithic dwelling, a rare find that offers a glimpse into the daily life and culture of these ancient people. The dwelling was discovered by a project led by Pablo Arias and Roberto Ontanen from the University of Cantabria, who have been studying the cave complex since 1996. The dwelling is an oval space of about 5 square meters, delimited by an alignment of stone blocks and stalagmites that supported a fixed structure of sticks and skins leaning against the cave wall. In the center of the space, there is a campfire where the inhabitants cooked their food and warmed themselves. Around the fire, archaeologists have found vestiges of various activities such as stone manufacturing, bone and antler working and fur processing. They have also recovered over 4,614 objects including animal bones, flint pieces, needles, a proto-harpoon, shells, pendants and decorated bones. One of the most remarkable objects is a pierced aurochs phalanx engraved with a depiction of both the animal itself and a human face. This is a distinctive artifact unique to the European Paleolithic era that shows the symbolic and artistic expression of these people. The dwelling is dated to around 16,800 years ago, and it is believed that it was occupied for a short period of time, perhaps a few weeks or months by a small group of people, possibly a family. The dwelling was then abandoned and the cave was sealed by a collapse, preserving the dwelling in a frozen state for millennia. Due to the national importance of the discovery, the team used innovative non-intrusive techniques in their study of the dwelling. This includes continuous tomography of the soils, 3D cartography, the molecular and genetic analysis of soils and paleolithic objects, mass spectrometry and hyperspectral imaging. These techniques allow the archaeologists to obtain detailed information about the dwelling and its contents without disturbing or damaging the fragile site. They also help to reconstruct the environmental and climatic conditions of the time as well as the social and cultural aspects of the Magdalenian people. The discovery of the paleolithic dwelling in the Lagama cave complex is a remarkable contribution to the understanding of the human past. It offers a rare glimpse into the life and art of the Magdalenian people who inhabited Europe during the last ice age. It also showcases the potential of modern technology to enhance the study and preservation of ancient heritage. We hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new about the Lagama cave complex and its Paleolithic dwelling. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thank you for watching and see you next time.